Hey guys, it's Ambar40 and today I'll be showing you how to downgrade in uh, any 3GS model with the Allocate exploit. Today I'm here with special guest Cypher. I mean, I'm not really here with him, but I'm on a Skype call with him. So, what's up Cypher? Hi. Alright, so um, first off, you are going to need uh, three things. iTunes, an actual 3GS. Um, right here, I have that. Preferably new boot ROM, but you can use this on the old boot ROM as well. You're going to need uh, a Snowbreeze IPSW. Here I have a 3.1.3 um, IPSW, so I will be restoring to that. First off, we're going to open up Red Snow. That's another thing you need. Um, go to Extras and Pawn DFU. That's going to quit oh. iTunes, don't worry. So now we're going to want to shut the iPhone off. And don't forget to get an old version of iTunes, um, 11.4 or older. All right, now we're going to click Next. Hold the power button for three seconds. Hold the um, power and bottom home button for 10 seconds. Then release the power button and continue holding the home button. And that will place you in DFU mode. It will then exploit with Lime Rain exploit, and now you should be in Pawn DFU mode, and you can restore to any firmware in iTunes. iTunes has detected if iPhone in recovery mode. Successfully entered Pawn DFU mode, so now we're going to hold the Alt key and click Restore iPhone. This will allow us to select any IPSW, so I'm going to use this Snowbreeze iPhone 3.1.3 uh, IPSW. I will not be showing you how to make a uh, Snowbreeze IPSW, although it's fairly easy, but you do need a Windows machine. You should get a white screen on your phone. Actually, no, you shouldn't. That's just an issue with my phone. And then you'll see that logo right there. That means that the um, downgrade is successfully taking place. Now you're going to wait for it to downgrade. Now that your iPhone has finished installing 3.1.3 or whatever firmware you chose, it'll reboot into a black screen and I iTunes will tell you that there's an iPhone in recovery mode. So this is where the Allocate exploit comes into play. Now to use um, iPawn DFU, which has Allocate, you're going to need to install LibUSB and PyUSB. To do this, you're going to need to use um, Easy Install. So you're going to type sudo easy underscore install followed by the password or er, um lib usb and type in the password and then it'll start installing it now you're going to do the same um command but with pi usb this will ensure that uh ipon dfu has the correct dependencies so now we are going to use ipon dfu to um install the allocate exploit and cypher will walk you through this all right then. So, firstly, you would want to type dot slash because that lets you execute programs in the current directory you're in. The name of the program is icon DFU, so just type that in. Here are the uses options. So, which one are we gonna use? Icon DFU dash p. Uh, there we go. So so now this will um, pawn your i. Uh, Gosh. This will put your device into a different pawn DFU mode than Red Snow did. It is um, very important that you use this uh, pawn DFU to install the allocate exploit instead of the Red Snow. All right. So we're installing to now, right? Yeah. And here we go. So first, it's going to dump the NOR, which is um, like. I don't even really know what it is. And then I, uh, iTunes hates this part. So now it's going to send IBSS and your phone should light up. And then um, the turn is like green. The, See, it is turned green, <laughs> which means it's successful. Yeah. Oh, why is um, iTunes like this? 
So now the phone should boot up, and if you used the um, IPSW that I supplied in the description, it will be automatically activated. So now the device should be booting up. Now the device is completely booted up and we have iOS 3.1.3 on your 3GS, which is a lot faster than 6.1.6. Alright guys, if you uh, liked the video, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe, tell Cypher not to drop his iPad, and thanks for um. watching.